Hi, I am Rachel Bugawan. I am Tisha Kayaka Pistrano. And I'm Mia Cariaga. And, and welcome, welcome to Lupao Nueva Ecija. Due to its history and cultural background, Lupawanian cuisine is greatly influenced by the Ilocanos and Pangasinenses. Rice is a staple food. Tinapa or smoked fish is also a famous dish which was commonly made locally in Ubok. Lupawanian also love their vegetables such as dinengdeng, a concoction of vegetables and fish sauce, and boiled kamote taps. Goat or kalding is a common treat for all occasions. It is a common ingredient on dishes such as pinapagitan, kilawin, and adobo. The locals are also fond of sweets like timudok, esmasol, putubumbok, tambo-tambo, itinginataang bayabas, tupi, kalamay, and inkiwang. Some of our exotic food are tatang usa or venison, baboy ramo or wild hog meat, and abuos and egg. Here are some of the delectable delicacies that you can try in Lupao, Nueva Ecija. Tinapa, a Philippine term which is cooked or preserved through a process of smoking. A product prepared from either full or filleted fish that has been cured and or cooked with salt and subjected to smoke produced by combustion of wood or other smoking materials. It is a native delicacy in the Lupao Nueva Ecija and is often made from black bean scud or Alipes melanopteran, known locally as galungo, or from milk fish, which is locally known as bangus. So, good afternoon po. Uh, ano pong pangalan nyo? Maria Lablin Bangus. Ang mana ko lang sa lola ko yan. Kasi nung hindi na siya nagkikina pa sa akin na pinansin. Almost 8 years na yun. Ano nung naman siya eh, pinapa ko nung kumpig tapos asin, tapos nilalaga, tapos pinapausok. Hindi kami masyado nagpapausok eh kasi kung pag pinausok mo ng matagal, um, matigas, tsaka pang ano yun, pang biyahe. Sa amin, cook lang, tapos uh, pausok konti, tapos benta. <laughs> Ubi Kalama is a popular gastronomic product from Lupao, Nueva Ecija. It is a sweet and sticky rice cake made from glutinous rice, flour, and coconut milk and purple yam or ube. The vibrant color of the kalamay comes from the ube which also adds a unique flavor to the dish. Ubi Kalamay is often topped with latik or a sweet coconut caramel sauce which adds a rich and creamy taste to the dessert. It is a delightful and indulgent treat that showcases the local flavors and culinary traditions of Lupao Nueva Ecija. Good morning po. Ano pong pangalan mo? Good morning din. Shaira Ma and Barcelona. 2013, nag-start na ako sa business na ganito. Hindi talaga, hindi ako nag-start sa kalamay ube. Nag-start ako sa mga maha, sa mga spaghetti, sa mga pasta. Siguro kaya lang nag-click yung kalamay ube ng Yumi's Foodies na gawa ko dahil sa love at saka passion ko talaga sa business. steaming ground purple rice mixture inside the bamboo tube. It is typically served topped with warm butter or margarine, grated or shredded coconut meat, and sprinkled with muscovado or brown sugar. In Lupao, Nueva Ecija, Jero's special Puto Bungbong is renowned for its delectable offerings of these festive treats. 
the establishment has crafted its own unique recipe featuring a diverse range of putubungbong options. These include the classic, special, and overload variants, each distinguished by its toppings and pricing. Ano pong pangalan nyo? Rowena Pascual, siya si JP Longalo. 2017 pa, 6 uh, years ago. Na, yun pa talaga, kasi malalaki yung putubongbong namin. Kasi usually ang putubongbong, maliliit lang, mga papayat. Yung itong sa aming matatawa. Kayo lang po ba yung putubongbong na naglalagay po ng sesame seeds sa ano, ipapaw? Hindi, hindi naman siguro, pero kami lang siguro yung putubongbong na nagdedressing na ora mismo. Thank you for joining us today. See you in our next gastronomic tour. Bye!